Hi hey, folks. So I just want to explain real quickly how you can reboot a server that you connect to over SSH. It's pretty simple, but it does use the sudo command because if you just run the command of reboot, which is how you restart without doing it, although it's so real quick, I'll connect to an SSH server, remove the typo from my command. All right, and we see that I've just logged into this box and it says system restart required. This is pretty common. Um, Various updates will have happened in the background that I'm running Ubuntu and it'll always give you this 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 warning if you log into a box via SSH that does need to be restarted. Um, and it's just best practice to follow those, those directives. So how do you do it? Well, the command to restart a server is just reboot, but I need to be root in order to reboot the server. So what I actually need to do is type server reboot and then it's gonna ask me for my password, which I'm gonna quickly, all right, pasting in our password. And so it tells me that the server is going down to reboot. What generally will happen is that the connection will automatically close on you. And that's exactly what you'd expect. The server is powering off um, and it's restarting. And so I can't SSH into it for a little bit while it reconnects. So if I do right now, connection refused. If I do it again in three seconds, I can finally connect because the server has come back up and it no longer says reboot required. So that's how you restart a server via SSH. Uh, pretty simple, but it does use sudo, which is I think a very good command to get some control over. All right.